making something beautiful gives you a sense of purpose and, and fulfillment that really no other pastime can. Whether it's card making or woodworking even, we all have inside of us the ability to make things and do things and produce things. And crafting is just about bringing that out. People love that satisfaction of making things. It's very important that you can achieve what I can achieve, and I make it easy for you to do that. I don't remember a time when I wasn't crafting. I don't know anything different but to craft. Well, we're continuing on with our 24-hour crafting day for Halloween. Uh, my name is Helen Keeney, and in this hour, we have the one and only Anna Griffin. We just heard, uh, you know, a little bit about her. Of course, she's a longtime, uh, so exciting member of our HSN family. We're going to give you a little peek at one of the very special items. This show is so beautiful. I can't wait to get into it. Um, we're going to talk about the uh, Trick or Treat bag box card, which is over which is over here yes there we go there we go yep there we go it's right here so take a look at these beautiful boxes we've got like a little example here you're getting these dies in order to create these this is one of the items that's going to be cutting coming up in our show here's here's an example of one of the items but we're gonna jump right in and start the show with the pumpkin card making kit, which is where I was. So let's go back over here. And I wanna introduce Anna and bring her into the show. Listen, she loves that old world design and making these beautiful card making. She is a, like, a president of Anna Griffin Inc. And I, I know I heard somebody introduce you that way earlier and I was like, you are a president girl. You are, you, you have forged this path and you have an entire industry. We're so lucky to have you as part of our HSN family. And this show is so fun and you have annified everything. <laughs> Thanks, Helen. Yeah, you know, it's funny. You wouldn't think you and I knew each other, but we've known each other a long time. I have, I've been uh, bringing our incredible crafts and products to HSN for over 13 years, but I have been a designer of beautiful paper goods for almost 30 years, and that is very exciting. So we're kicking this hour off, Helen, with the cutest of the card-making kits that we brought to HSN. Now, we designed everything for you and we put it together in a way this is the simply rocking pumpkin card making kit it's all inclusive it's something that you take with you and put on a table like if you're going over to your your girlfriend's house and you want to make something together watch this Helen right it's a cute card it's a pumpkin but look at what happens it rocks the card has two different ways of working we have jack-o-lanterns and then we have pumpkins oh and you just have to you have to pay, put your embellishments in just the right place so that everything rocks once you've got this together. Now, 120 some odd pieces to create 12 rocking pumpkin cards, which is so much fun. And inside the box, right, the, the box, you can put all your cards when they're finished inside the box, which is, I think, you know, we, we give you a solution pretty much every way that we turn. So when you open the box, you're getting bagged embellishments. These are wonderful for decorating the pumpkin, whether it's the jack-o'-lantern side or the pumpkin side. We give you these little um, structure pieces that keep the card rocking back and forth. We give you pre-tied ribbons. There are 12 of those. And then there are 12 sentiments. And I'm just going to show you how much fun this is to make. Now, we're watching tonight and you're like, oh, okay, I just saw her make that. How do I do that at home? Well, this comes with a complete instruction guide. And I think that's what's really unique about what we do. We take care of you from start to finish inside our card kits. And this comes inside that set. Now, what's the neat about the set is we have die cut the cards already. Each one of these is designed with patterns. So we've got purple and we've got black and they've all got foil stamping on them. But here's the fun part. They're already die cut. So all you do is push and pull this back, right? And it's going to rock. Okay, so that's the part that rocks. And then you choose, like you can choose the traditional jack-o'-lantern 
or uh, you can easily flip this over as a layer and decorate it as a pumpkin. Now, I think that's really cool and you need nothing. You want for nothing because we give you the envelopes, the square envelopes for the cards, and we give you foam adhesive to put everything together so it doesn't get any simpler than that. So we're gonna, I'm gonna pick one. So there's a, a really nice little beige one. We're gonna put the pumpkin on top and you just put that double-sided foam adhesive on the back of that layer. And let me just push that up so that you can see it. Now, this is the part where we have engineered this little structure piece that comes with adhesive already applied to it, to the ends, and you fold it to create this little accordion shape. And then you, op you basically open the card right at the bottom. And so we're gonna put it right here and then we're gonna stick it down. So I'm gonna hold it down and close the pumpkin on top of it. Now, this is not going to fall open, right? So this is gonna keep it structurally sound. And then now you see, without even decorating it, it's gonna rock. And then this is so much fun because we put together these neat little flowers and flourishes. And so you can create your own composition. You can add that little ribbon to the top of the stem of the pumpkin. You can even, there are even butterflies included. I'm gonna put that sort of in the center so everything is symmetrical so that when we do rock the pumpkin, right? We can rock it back and forth. Depending on how you put these together, you see that same exact example here with the things at the top. This is a great thing for a teacher gift, right? If you're thinking about what is it that we're gonna do for Halloween, right? Maybe we're gonna do that little treat bag that you showed. We're gonna fill it with treats, but we also wanna give a card. And what's so nice about these, it's all you have to do, sign the back. You can write a little message on the back of the pumpkin, put it in the envelope. And this is a great gift. So when we're, I, you know, I know I'm always thinking about what I'm gonna do during these, the Halloween Halloween holiday, right? And I want to make it simple for myself and I made it simple for you in doing that as well. So again, we just fold it back. We take the foam adhesive, you put it on the back of the layer. It goes right in the center of the pumpkin face. Again, depending on how you want to decorate this, I love this. This is, this is a, a girly little pumpkin. She's got happy Halloween. And then you have to this is all you have to do. You peel off the adhesive cover on that little structure. All right, and then again, you just fold it back and forth like, like a little ribbon, and then it goes right at the base of the card. And that this is the part that if you've ever tried to make a rocking card by yourself, like one without any kind of structure like this, it tends to open very quickly. So that means it just falls flat and doesn't rock anymore. So we've, we've just solved that for you. And inside this, Helen, you've got every single thing you need. You don't even need scissors. Isn't that fun? It is fun. And it's also a weekly deal drop. So this dropped on Monday and the price goes till Sunday, but I've noticed we've sold over 10 10,000 of these. I mean, so incredibly uh, popular. You're getting everything. And just like Anna says, you're even getting the foam dots. You're getting the envelopes. And here's my favorite part of my Anna collection of cards is on the back. It's, it's made by, you can hand sign it. So you know it's made by. So let me show you this. This, this is the, uh, you know, signed by, handmade by. I love that you do that, Anna, in that beautiful kind of gold foiling. Because it makes, every time I sign my name to one of your cards I feel like I feel like I've accomplished something and my friends like look at the back and they go oh did you you make that yeah well I created this but if you make it so easy I have so many of your card kits but I don't have the pumpkin this is I've never seen this it looks so amazing everybody's loving it it's flying out the door well, it's brand new for today, Helen, and we have we have brought the rocking card kit mechanism in our die sets to HSN. We did a rocking Valentine card, so it was only natural that we added the pumpkin to our repertoire. And just think, like you can make a serious Halloween card right with the pump, the vintage pumpkin design decorated uh, on the left and right side, or just flip over that that layer and create a jack o' lantern for something just a little more fun. So really it's up to you. So if, if, if your style is more serious, right? You're mm -hmm. kind of gonna want this pumpkin side, but if you're funny like Helen is, you're gonna want the jack-o'-lantern <laughs> and you're gonna wanna say something very fun on the back. 
I love it. I love it. By the way, I do have a cardstock from Anna that goes back with it, the glitter cardstock. Let me just hold this up. I know it's honestly, I know you can see it at home, but when you get it, you get your order. The, the quality of this cardstock is just incredible. Um, you're getting a set of 18 of the glitter cardstock. I'd look at these colors. These colors are just, I mean, I just look at that. Is that not a, <laughs> look at how beautiful, how beautiful. And then of course, you know, the purple, and I know you've got some samples of this, Anna, but you know, these are, this is just the best. And none of the glitter comes off. People ask me that, it does not come off. Right, well that's the actual secret sauce, Helen. It's silk screen glitter. It's not gonna come off on your hand. It's gonna die cut perfectly. It's gonna fold perfectly. You're gonna be able to use these for all your projects. Use them for all, all your projects. So we're gonna continue on. We've got so many amazing items in this one hour we have with Anna. We're gonna talk about some 3D concentric die frames that are a bit scary. <laughs> a bit scary. Um, I. Are we gonna, yeah, we could, we've got to shoot these because they look so beautiful with the, the pumpkins and the, you're getting, you're getting a set of these dies, you're getting eight of them. And they're, again, just so beautiful. Like to take Halloween and to have it be this kind of vintage, old world, yet kind of fun, uh, spooky, not not really scary. And you see, look at these gorgeous cards that that you can make with these dies. Anna, I love the little expression on the pumpkin's face. He's like, oh, <laughs> something just <laughs> happened. <laughs> Right, it's a, it's a little thought bubble of a pumpkin. Yeah. And what's so pretty about this, Helen, is that we use our 3D dye technology, which is where we, we draw the beautiful artwork that you see that the dye is going to engrave, emboss, and cut at the same time. And this is a concentric set. So with each one of these, right, you're getting multiple dyes. And you see how each one of these has an interior dye and an exterior dye so that you can cut all these layers layers. And when we're talking about the layers, we're talking about everything that you see in white and in gold. So you see how we go from the back to the front, all the way to the little pumpkin. And I think one of the really special details is this spider web where the spiders look like bows at the top and the bottom of the center. And then you're surrounded by beautiful leaves. So if you're creating something scary for Halloween, we're still doing it in that beautiful in the making kind kind of way, which is what we do so well. Meaning we take something that is ordinarily a particular emotion, right? You know, we, we, we tend to lean towards pretty, but when we make something scary, right, it's still absolutely beautiful. So one of the things that's what neat about the die sets is that we give you really great ideas that um, come with the dies. And if you're cutting for the first time, we're gonna, I'm gonna use my Empress machine to show you how to nest all of these layers together to create some very spooky and scary frames. We're using a black matte foil cardstock that's coming up in the show. And what's so fun about our matte foil cardstock is how luxurious it is. So when you're using a 3D die and or using any die in your craft room, doesn't have to be these, but this matte foil cardstock really shows those details. So we just nested a bunch of dies, right, to create this beautiful outer layer frame, this in incredible inner layer frame with that with those leaves and you see I just want to be somewhat careful because that's so much detail with those leaves you'll tear it but you see how we're creating very spooky layers to create uh, I'm gonna make a card here Helen hold on okay. um, so exciting right so we start with something somewhat plain um, and then Look at this, we've just mounted the, the first frame to the shadow layer in gold where we've also cut out the middle. So you would nest the dies to get that to happen. That black layer is underneath an orange layer and this is from our luxury um, fall matte foil cardstock that was on earlier today. And then you see we're going all the way to the middle. So we're co coordinating colors, we're inlaying all those wonderful colors. And believe it or not, we're gonna have that little pumpkin 
and saying, saying, um, uh, ooh, and and right here. Let's just let's just put him right here. Or <laughs> maybe I think it just needs to go right there. And you see how, right, all of that comes together. So that's just a series of cuts and die cuts with different beautiful papers. So um, I think that's pretty easy, but if you're if you're thinking about what you're going to make for Halloween, these are this is a card making die set that will last you for many, many seasons. Yeah, and we do have available the Empress die cutting machine on your screen that is in Anna's signature card colors of that beautiful gold and ivory. So I wanted to mention that we've seen Anna use it. Um, Anna has given me a few examples to show you here in our studio, but um, there's, that, there's that little pumpkin and they're just so beautiful and very, you know, here we've done like, you know, 3D multi-dimensional, but it's the 3D concentric frames. They, that's how they're meant because they're in, in and of themselves sort of building on it. And the one that we've got down here with, with the gold, you really see see it, how, how that pumpkin can pop in that three-dimensional way. So you see, when I when I go like that, you see how it's, it's built, like with the foam dots. You see, that's really the magic right there. It's built. But when you see it, look at look at how elegant. I mean, only, Anna, only you could make elegance, uh, uh, <laughs> spooky elegance. I think that's a new, a new thing right. you created. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you how easy that is to create. So once again, you're, you're starting with that beautiful background frame. So the full five by seven of the frame. And then you, if you cut all of these dies out of different papers, you can go back and mix and match. You can actually make more than one card at a time just by saving all of your pieces. And we love building to the center, like concentrically, when we're creating with these dies. So, so we've got that little pumpkin again we've got a you've cast a spell on me and then we've got oh th this was really fun today we had some perfect bows in halloween and fall colors so you're able to create cards very simply and easily with this frames that work for you know of course we're showing this to you for for halloween and for fall but again the leaf frame in the center is so beautiful. You can use it all the way through to Thanksgiving. Uh, the, the designs are going to lend themselves to all kinds of things. And when you need a fancy corner, you can cut this apart, right? The background die can become an embellishment die and not just the frame. So there are lots of ways to look at this. This is our newest concentric die set. We like to uh, design them for HSN to match all of the seasons. And and we have a Christmas version and a birthday version coming up that I don't know if we're going to get to show them or not, but this same concept occurs for all the holidays. Yeah, and again, these are, everything we have is limited, and I will say, before we even got to the show, you were all going on hsn.com and doing a lot of shopping. We've got five flex pay on absolutely everything, and don't forget about the shipping special. Spend $7.50 to fill your cart. No matter, you could buy everything in the show. It's $7.50 to, to be able to ship it. We've got our final minute on this die set, and we've got lots more. There's actually a um, 3D concentric die set in Christmas or birthday also. So if you want to get the same kind of thing, perfect five-star customer pick in those two choices as well, we do have available. Uh, you can see that that little adorable pumpkin like kind of popping out right in the middle. You obviously can use these dies for other things. They have that beautiful elegance that uh, Anna is known for. And then of course in her ivory and gold color scheme on sale today at $26.95. Five flex pay on everything. So I love that you're getting this home for just $5.39. Pat, are we gonna mention the Christmas and the birthday i do want to mention that okay goody all right so here is the uh christmas and birthday so i will show you a couple of cards so here's the christmas die it's the same kind of concentric 3d you use those foam dots and this is the dies that you're getting and here's an example of a card in the uh, merry christmas you can see it's sort of done with the the pinks and then you know you can use a lot of these pieces uh and again perfect five-star customer pick 
and you see that look at those sort of the swag here really gorgeous and then we have birthday again the same kind of 3d concentric um, in here and I've got a card an example a few cards so here here's what you get for birthday it's beautiful elegant versatile and then here is a birthday a way to do it with birthday and there's some beautiful things Anna's showing you as well Anna this this well, is another great choice <laughs> Well, okay, so I would love to like back up two seconds and that is that the 3D technology is that incredible technology that engraves the paper. It not only embosses and die cuts, it engraves the design into the paper. So if you're thinking you're creating for Christmas, right, it's beautiful garlands and for birthday, it's these gorgeous wheels in the corners of each of the layers that you can create. So this is the same concept as the scary concentric. We've got birthday birthday and Christmas available. Okay, so the item number's on your screen. It's 075372. And speaking of Halloween, we're going to talk about this black matte and foil cardstock. So you see the matte and then you see the shimmer. Let me kind of lift them up. So you, see, I want everybody to see them at home. You see how this has like sort of a shine to it? This one is genuinely like matte. It is a very, very heavy cardstock. And it's $39.95 for all your spooky needs. We've got 12 by 12 here, and then I also have it available in the other size, which is six by eight. So you're getting- it comes with it. Yeah, you're getting all of it. You're not choosing. You're not like, yes. should I get one or the other? You're getting this huge pile, 72 sheets in all. <laughs> yeah, huge pile. Huge, huge pile. pile of three. <laughs> 300 GSM cardstock. Now, what that means, all right, grams per square meter is a big deal in paper manufacturing. That means that it's the highest quality paper. Not only do we start with our beautiful ivory cardstock, okay, so on the back, all of our card making kits, everything is this beautiful milky white. Now, we have custom made the foil paper. We have a matte and a shiny foil application in the 12 by 12, and then we have it again in the six by eight so that you can create that tonal effect, which I think is really, really interesting. Now, this was one of the biggest customer requests of all time. We have had little pieces of this cardstock used sparingly for many, many seasons. And now you have a full 72 sheets. Now, adding that, right, you see how we've got that tonal effect, right? Shiny and matte. We have, we have this coming up in just a few minutes, but do you see how matte works for the coffin box, shiny works for Dracula's suit and hair. Now that's Gosh. where we that want- That dye of really Dracula wanna... in the coffin, Anna, I was like, is that Anna did that? Like that was like the cutest, my favorite thing I think of the entire show that's coming up. <laughs> yeah, um, yes, hold on to your broomstick because that <laughs> one's going to go. So yeah. um, here's what's so fun about having this beautiful matte black. You can use it for all of the occasions, right? Because, right, the, the shiny and the matte, they're going to work to deliver just that right amount of sheen for your card making for fall, right? You see how it stands up against color? The shiny one gives you a texture and I don't know about you but every time I see those cars that are that are painted in in this matte finish I do a double take I like I'll go wait a minute cars used to be just glossy now they're these matte colors so we can do that with our cards yeah there's 550 left and I'll tell you when you get these home and feel the the you know the weight of these it's really I mean I we've had a lot of you know great papers and cards this is real the real deal Carl cardstock this is gonna stand up over time and they're very very popular 530 I mean you can get a couple of orders a tis the season to get this and you will do so many things you're getting 12 by 12 and then you're also getting the other size which is the 6 by 8 so you're getting 12 by 12 and 6 by 8 72 count it is a big big uh, quantity there so what would look beautiful now you got your matte black and then also you've got your uh, that beautiful like with the sheet how about some perfectly scary paper rosettes? So this isn't like, all right, we have a, you know, 87 step guide to creating these 
yourself. No, Anna gives you a bag of these and they have all those great, you know, black and orange and gold. And this one has like, like spider webs. Uh, you could see the Anna, this is so perfect because all you do adhesive and go and you look like a, you know, a genius. I love this one with the right. spider Helen. foil. I have the most incredible projects that I have to show. Okay. Okay. Starting with with a wand, right? Everybody needs a wand for Halloween for fun. Made with a straw. The perfectly scary rosette is on both sides, right? Just add a little ribbon and some stickers. That is so incredibly fun. But each one of these, they're all they're double sided right? They're a miniature version of those giant ones that you hang on the wall, but they go on your projects, right? Right. If you have a little um, project that you want to bring to life, these are so beautiful. Okay. But this is what I want to show you, right? We, we're, we're thinking about creating, right? Something fantastic for Halloween, something to hang on the door, something to welcome people to your house. Look, it says boo, but each one of these, one of the scary rosettes is on each one. And we just added a letter to the front of it. And, you know, big shout out to Annabelle, who just loves to make these wonderful big projects. And this is so simple to make. Now, if you're thinking about creating treat boxes, right, uh, you know, other than the ones that are dyed, make oh, look at the embellishments and how easy this becomes something you know very festive in just like you said adding the a little bit of adhesive so 24 of these come to you double-sided, all foil stamped, all pleated. Now I've taught people all over the world how to do this by hand, folding over and under and using a glue gun and having those circles and, and sandwiching it together. This is done in a way that we have created the first set of these. We've done perfect, perfect rosettes for uh, Christmas before. We've never done them for Halloween. And you know, the following event here on HSN today, this is the perfect time to have the very best things, right? So look at how festive these make your cards. They really bring it all to life. It's like a Ferris wheel for the front of a five by seven card. It gives you movement. It gives you excitement. It gives you a place to add your sentiments and I'm going to make something really quick just to show you how cute this is just to start adding them right so if you've got a, a cute little card that you've started with now the tw they're 24 you add double-sided adhesive to this and we're I believe it or not we're gonna I think we're gonna cover this up how interesting um, I think that I want them in the corners if we're gonna cover it up as a project there we go lots of movement happening right there we're gonna use three on one project, my goodness. All right, boo to you. I think that cat needs to go right in the center and say boo. And then adding a little ribbon, okay, fun, right? That's uh, That looks like it took a lot of time to create, but simply it was it was a uh, add some adhesive, stick it down. And the fun thing is if you like to make spin spinning cards, right? You can hang one of these in the window of a card and, and it's going to work so perfectly because because it's the same on the front and the back. So each one, 24, Helen, we're just, I, I'm just having quite the party over here. I came for the candy. This is a great way. Look, we've cut one in half, made a candy wrapper out of the oh, rosette. Oh, that's clever. Like a little, like a little wrapping of the candy. That's so cute. Yeah, yeah, lots of fun with these. And so I think that if you were taking your time and trying to create these out of a strip of paper, it, by the time you got, you know, you got yeah. one done, all 24 of these could already be adorning cards and treat bags and all the things that you're using for Halloween. I love the idea of the treat bags. Like you're getting 24 of them, you get, you get a couple of orders and then you've got all these cute treat bags. People will be so impressed when they come to your house. $46.95 was the regular price. Price, but they are on sale for $34.95 today. And don't forget, you fill your cart. Your shipping and handling is $7.50 total, no matter how many things you get. And you get a whole big bag of these. Now, we are going to take a little bit of a break. And when Anna and I come back, we've got something called a five and five. It's five items and one minute per item. So that's going to be coming up. Now, I did want to mention coming up this Saturday, we are celebrating 
the 25th anniversary of Wolfgang Puck. I'm going to tell you, there is something on the page that is going to be the Today Special. It is an amazing 25th anniversary cookware set, so I would definitely tune, on a, tune in on Saturday. But we are starting to pop those things up on hsn.com. You know how that goes. Popular things sell out before we can even blink an eye. So that's very exciting. All right, well, we're going to take a teeny little break. Don't forget, we come back 5 and 5 with Anna and I. Lots of great items, but just one minute per item, so stay tuned. I just crave the simple things because... Get the best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks, like VIP financing on so many items, plus extra flex on every item under $369, all day, every day, and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Includes fraud protection, and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash hsncard. This Friday, get first dibs on sale with all new fall items for your home. The Beekman Boys will be here with their newest fall scents, new premieres, and join Adam and Amy for a spooktacular Halloween special. Cozy up with the fall home event. Starts Friday at midnight. Thank you so much for watching HSN. I'm Helen Keeney, and I am hosting the hour with have the star of the show, which is Anna Griffin. And we're about to do five items, one minute per item. I'm just going to introduce the item, and Anna's going to take it away, and we're going to start right now. Take it to the Celebration Floral Rub-On Set. Um, you're getting everything in this beautiful box. Here are the gorgeous floral rub-ons. Um, Anna will take it through 4.9 star customer pick. These are the beautiful florals that you're getting, Anna. I know we've only got a minute on these, so I'm going to turn it over to you. Okay, great. So what's important about a rub-on is that this is 125, 28 beautiful designs that can be transferred to paper, to ribbon, to glass. It looks like it's printed. All you're doing is rubbing the, cutting the design out, rubbing it onto the substrate of your choice. It makes it look like it came that way. And you have so much versatility, creativity. You can cut them, you can add them. This is six different rub-ons all made on that one envelope flap. You're getting every flower in the garden in the 128, and this is on, printed in a special way where there's an opaque white behind each one of the flowers. So when you transfer it to pattern paper or even solid paper, the flower still shows through. Gorgeous. All right, the item number is on your screen. It's 834-215. Like I said, big customer pick. Speaking of customer pick, our next item, 4.9 out of 5-star customer pick as well. It is the Hummingbirds. You are getting 40 hum Hummingbird sticker embellishments for each of 10 designs, and then 40 Hummingbird sticker sentiments for each of 10 designs. So the sentiments... And then the hummingbirds. And hummingbirds are such a trend, Anna. This is such a beautiful set of stickers because what they are, they're reproductions of 18th century and 19th century wash on paper paintings. These are beautiful watercolors of the actual hummingbirds. We've got them in flight and with flora and fauna. Then we have the sentiments that go with it. So if you're, you're, you were in my thoughts, happiest birthday wishes, wishing you sunshine and happiness, 
the things that you want to say when you're creating a card with a hummingbird on the front. These are garden-worthy hummingbirds. Look at just how they work with those beautiful flowers. You can adorn cards and uh, beautiful tags and all kinds of things with these beautiful pictures. Under $20, too. 813-460, under $20. All right, this is so cool. This is a square box die set. It's a square box card die set. So here are the dies. This is the box that you can make. You open it up and you see there's like a depth of field in there. It's like a box. So obviously there's so many things you can do with this. It's on sale for $39.95. Five flex space, so $7.99. You also get an idea sheet with the technical instructions on how to make this. And it is a customer pick as well. 834-241, Anna. Okay, so well, let's start over. When you're thinking about creating something that's three-dimensional, this is a die that's gonna do that. You need a large plate system for your die cutting machine. What's gonna happen is that we have we have not only cut the edges, you fold it's all scored, so you fold it into the center. The mitered corners happen automatically because of the way that the die is designed, so that you get this perfect box shape. It's a quarter inch in depth and you can create it on the front of the card or you can create it to be like a book and open. We've done so many classes on creating these little book cards. This is a joy to receive. Okay, so the item number is 834-241 with that um, square box card die set. We're now gonna move on to a two pad cardstock set. You're getting Blythe, which is the old world painting. It's an HSN exclusive. And also the Eleanor, which is the, those blacks, pinks, and whites. Um, I'm gonna try to show you these cards. I know Anna has this, but these are, again, this is what Anna is known for. It's like these incredible, beautiful recreations of vintage ideas. Look at that, look at this. And I wanna show you the purple. I'm um, trying to go fast here, but Anne, I know you've got these in front of you as well. And this was this was part of a choice of, and the other one sold out. We all oh, look at that. Look at how this gorgeous is, that this is. This is actually you're getting both pads. There's 36 sheets in each pad, and this is the quintessential Anna Griffin uh, palette of old world patterns from the 18 and 1800s and early 1900s. Everything color coordinated to work together. Life is a, one of the most beautiful paintings in my archive. It is reproduced here. Eleanor, the entire collection is here. Also designed to coordinate effortlessly every single piece. And this Eleanor um, is going to be something that you'll be seeing on HSN next year um, in April. Very exciting. There's a little tease for you in our five and five. Okay, so the item number is on your screen and we're gonna continue on with our last of our five and five. This is a choice of the Eiffel Tower where you have the Eiffel Tower, a little cafe, kind of this gas lamp, um, you know, very scenes of Parisian scenes. And then the other choice is holiday, holiday tree, wreath, gifts, 4 of 0.8 out of five star customer pick, your choice of the 3D die set, and we're doing a clearance price of only $17.95, which is clearance on something like Holiday or Paris. I'm not sure how it never goes out of style, right? <laughs> well, what's important, Helen, is that this is one of our absolute all-time best die sets, this one right here. And to see this today, this is going to create a three-dimensional scene of Paris, the 3D dies. You're getting the most incredible detail out of the dies, and you're able to create, like you said, that beautiful Parisian scene in perspective, meaning there's a lamppost and a little table. What's so neat about the holiday version, you're getting, whether you're creating an interior or exterior view of a holiday scene. What's so nice about this is that you can use the tree, the candles, decorate the window. I don't have one that really shows you what it all does all together, but you get the idea, the outside or the in with the holiday scene.
Yes, seventeen dollars and ninety-five cents clearance price zero nine four zero one seven. All right, so we're gonna continue on. I'm I'm not gonna lie, this is my favorite. I know I'm not supposed to pick favorites, but when I saw this die, I just was like, I absolutely love it. I think it's so. You know, I've never seen anything like it. So it is the Halloween cough, coffin box card die. It is so cute. Look at that. That's like a little vampire inside a little coffin. And here's like an example that Anna has sent to us so that we could show you. And I know she's going to take you through this. And, you know, you open you open up the card. It's And you can see it's like three-dimensional box. Like, how cute is it? Anna, I don't know how you guys think of these things, but this is just, I mean, I mean, I think it's so fun. So, uh, Helen, one of the things that I think that we have done so spectacularly yeah. over the last 14 years on HSN is that we continue to innovate, and I think that's what this is about, right? We just looked at that little square box die card um, that in the five and five. This is the Halloween answer in a, in a geometry project. The same things are going to happen. The, fold, the sides are going to fold in, all of it's scored, and this is engineered in a perfect way to create a, a corner that overlaps in this odd shape. Now, what's neat about what we do for HSN is that we guide you from the minute you open the box all the way through the finishing of your first card. We've given you what to cut, how to cut it, where to put the adhesive, how to put the little Dracula inside the coffin, and we've given you composition ideas to put it together. That is really cool. Now, if you were making this for the first time, you need a large plate system. I know you can't, I don't know if you can see all of that, but this is a, our large Empress plate system. It is 12 inches long. It's more than eight inches wide. So this is going to create a very big box and you would die cut that. Now what happens once it's die cut is that these are the pieces. All right. So this is really important to see. So on all the score lines, you're going to fold. All right. You're going to fold in just like all of our box dies, right? You're going to fold all the way to the center and there's adhesive creating a little tube. All right. So with each each one of these we're just going to fold to the center and we're creating that box shape. Now as you're, I'm just going to do the bottom one so that you can see, I'm going to show you this up close. When you fold it in completely, what you, what you need to do is pay attention right here. That's where the mitered corner happens. All right. So this is, a, this needs to hold and you're going to do the same thing at the top. You're going to roll in the sides okay, to create this. Now, and the very first time you do this, one of the things you, you have to get used to is like where the adhesive needs to go. And so mine's not sticking. You, I, I would definitely take your tool in one or, or a pin to give yourself a little uh, extra help in getting the adhesive to stick. And then we're going all the way on the sides across the top and we're creating the, the coffin shape itself, okay? So that, what, what, What's happening there is that this is what it looks like when it's completely finished. And we use the die once again and cut it one more time and cut away the edge. All right, uh, so instead of that folded edge, we're gonna just make ourselves a lid to the coffin and it's just going to adhere to down the left-hand side so that it opens perfectly. Now, Dracula can get decorated with a fancy suit. Um, we <laughs> love patterned paper for Dracula. We like to give him, you know, funny, uh, he's got a funny expression on his face and you would decorate this card inside and out. So if you've got Halloween stickers or you wanna, you know, decorate the let's let's have him hold the candle and you know there's just so many things that you can do with this card that um, I'm just gonna blow you away here ready imagine um, the front door of your house and you were thinking we're, we're back to Annabelle again the builder so imagine this greeting the trick-or-treaters this fall fun right three wonderful coffin boxes I'll show it to you up close so that you can see you can get an idea oh, look at that. I think How this cute even he's wearing a smile. Isn't that great? So the boxes become the decoration for the wreath. Now, if you send this in the mail, right, it's a five by seven, so it's gonna fit in a five by seven envelope. I would make sure that you're using 
one of our gusseted envelopes or making something custom because of the depth of the box. But this is so fun. You could actually make this light up. You could make it talk. You could do one of those little recorded cards. Um, I, and as a kid, this was my favorite thing to do was have spooky sounds, um, soundtracks and records playing. Yes, I said records um, <laughs> from way back in the day. I know what day. you meant. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know. Well, isn't that fun? There was, there were, let's see, there were records, and then there were eight-track tapes, then there were cassette tapes, and then there were uh, CDs, and uh, and then you know, gosh, what do we have now? We have streaming music. So, right. so Dracula needs a little soundtrack here, and every time you open this, we should play the Monster Mash and have a great time. So, isn't this clever? I think this is the probably the most fun thing that we brought for this entire event to. Day, um, the coffin box died. Oh, I, I absolutely, I saw that and I, I could not wait to see a project that, you know, you've got some samples. As a matter of fact, coming up next, we've got some papers that would be absolutely perfect to use for your coffin, your Dracula, Dracula suit. Um, and we're going to show you all of those. It's $41.95. We are doing five flex pay, our whole house event, five flex pay on everything. We ship with the first payment. You will be making your cute little, I, I mean, this is so great for like a little Halloween party. This is great for card setting. I love the home decor ideas. Uh, you could make a little coffin and put it on the outside of a gift bag. I mean, of course, it, you know, the ideas are endless. But $8.39 is your flex pay. And then you only pay $7.50 to fill your cart. Here's your cart. You're filling it up. You're filling it up. No matter what you put in your cart, the $7.50 price tag is all you'll pay to ship all day long. To me, this is the most uh, creative, unique, architectural uh, uh, interesting and new design that I've seen. I mean, this is really, really cool. You will totally be uh, the fanciest crafter in the block if you have this. So, the, <laughs> I, right, Anna? I mean, I honestly, I was, when I saw this, it's kind of like an architectural marvel, but it, yeah, I watch you build it. It looks very, very easy to make and it comes with an idea sheet too. It, it does, and we give you, we walk you through it step by step. You're, you're you're cutting and scoring at the same time, so that the folds are precise, so that you can actually make this shape in a precise way. And that's what's really you know different about it. We we. We make sure that we are giving you, you know, we're setting you up for success with everything that we design for HSN. We, we make sure that what you get, and when you get it out of the box, that everything has been tried and tested perfectly every time so that you can achieve what I can achieve. Oh, yeah. And and the item number is 853729. I do want to show the uh, cardstock, which is double sided. So you can see all these beautiful designs. I'm going to take, I'll take one out. I'll take out the, like, the spider web that you see. Look at just the quality. And then you've got, you see the foiling. And it is double sided. So I think it would be obviously perfect for all your, you know, crafting, home decor items. Just, I mean, look at, look at how gorgeous. And every single one of these double-sided, Anna. I mean, your pay, that's kind of like where you started is with the, the paper and the stationery. Well, yeah. everything that we make is paper related. I call myself a paper personality even, <laughs> which is really fun because my background, like I, I, I'm a graphic designer. So one of the things that I love the most is paper. And so our patterns are created, original patterns created from beautiful antique things. And with this set, right, there's 24 sheets. You're getting a tonal version of the pattern. You're getting double-sided cardstock. But when you look at the foil stamp version of the same pattern, it really comes to life. So no matter how you are using this, right, if you're using scary words or beautiful little, you know, dots that work really great for creating treat bags or coffin boxes, we've got spider webs with foil. We even have that little heartbeat pattern. Again, there's dots inside. There are lace. We have two different versions of the lace, one in orange and black and one in black and white. This is where things get really useful in, in creating with this, right? So we have damask, and look at that. That is one of the most beautiful papers that I think we make, that black and gold. If you're going to create something, you know, maybe even for New Year's Eve, this is a beautiful paper. If you're taking, thinking about making an invitation, there 
here, there's another black and gold in this as well. So we, this is this is the fancy stuff. Like when you go to the paper store and you're looking at those slots of paper, this is the this is the paper that where you end up paying just a little more for it because it's got all of that fancy foil stamping. So it's 230 GSM cardstock, and what's so great about that is that that's a really high quality cardstock, and it's ivory on the back, so it's going to match any of the things that you have in our line. Um, so, so meaning, I'm sorry, it's, it's, I'm just going to tear this to show you. It's non-solid core, so it's ivory on the inside. So if you're making a scary project, like a scrapbook page or something, you've got that beautiful ivory cardstock base that we start with. So I think that this is really fun for all kinds of things, especially scrapbooking. And I'm surprised that we don't have anything here to show you with this paper set that would be for scrapbooking, like, because kids' costumes and putting all of those things together for commemorating this holiday is, is one of my favorite ways to use 12 by 12 paper. Yeah, I mean, the, I just, it's endless how, and, and the fact that it's double-sided, Anna was just showing this one, and this is the back of it, where you're seeing like, I mean, this would be really, really cute too for, you know, the Halloween, look at, look at how gorgeous that foiling is. I mean, think about how much you would pay just for one, one of these sheets in a fancy craft store that, you know, $28.95. I know it was only on one other time for two seconds, and I think 600 plus have already sold. We're through half the quantity that we have for the entire fall by showing it one time for a minute. This is the most time it's been on air that anyone's ever seen it. 853-742. We're gonna continue on and we've got um, these trick or treat bags. I think that's what we're gonna do next, yeah. Now, we gave you a little bit of a peek at these at the beginning. Take a look at Frankenstein. You got your kitty cat, got your pumpkin, and this is the construction this is the framework to make these trick-or-treat bags or of course you can make uh the box cards as well and i know anna will give you all the details but i mean just the architecture of this and the i mean i love the little frankenstein you can tell what i love i love the frankenstein i love the uh, little vampire in the coffin <laughs> it's just i mean i think it's just so fun and cute and it's spooky you know kind of fun and spooky not not scary at all but then you've got you got the cat it's I, I just these are so original it's like an original take on something that have been around for forever i love it that was crazy. There were all these bubbles over me just then. It's like very spooky. Um, it's it's uh, definitely Halloween at Hall uh, HSN today. Now, what's so fun about creating for you that are watching, right? You love to craft. You're always looking for something new to uh, ignite your creativity. And that's what we love to do. So this die set is, it's not going to make a card. It's, back, it's making a bag or a box, okay? So you're cutting the main strip structure of this two times to create the bag or the box. And then you're decorating with all these other dies. And what's so fun about it is that we give you a handle die so that you can create this little spider handle. You can add the little kitty cat to the front. You can add the Frankenstein. All of these are filled with candy. And what's so cute, right? You can do the little bobblehead uh, things for the pumpkin, add your favorite ribbons, tissue, right? All the things that that you know you think about that you're going to create for maybe your kids are going trick-or-treating this year I know there's a lot of kids uh, here in our office and we love to see the costumes but what they trick-or-treat here in the office or they used to which was fun and they would bring candy to your desk now this is the way that someone needs to do that I'm going to show you how simple that that can be so we give you this incredible step-by-step uh, -step guide to creating the boxes and again it tells you how many to cut, what to do, how to assemble the box or the bag, whatever you're making, handle or no handle, and then how to decorate it. So we don't we we don't stop there, right? We're gonna take we're gonna take you on a creative journey. You're gonna use your die cutting machine. We have our Empress machine, and we're gonna cut that 
card stock that we just saw um, a few minutes ago. And what's so pretty about that is that, um, I, re I remembered this earlier today, you don't use the metal shim with this die because the, the die has so much metal. It's a heavy duty die, right? And we've got card stock and you're gonna cut two of these at the same time. You know, you can cut two at the same time because it's gonna score the edges. It's gonna create the tabs for the box and everything you need is in this one die. So you all you have to do is cut that that twice. Now here's what's neat. We didn't have to measure. We just cut it. Uh, and everything about this is just folds perfectly, right? That we don't have to score it. Everything's scored perfectly. The tabs for the bottom of the box, right? They fold up and they connect. And we've just made one side just by doing that. We just need to add a little glue. Now, when we're putting this together, one of the things I'm going to show you how simple that is, is that we put the two that we created back to back or side to side. And here, what we've done is we've put them, um, the, we've overlapped the flaps. So you have a nice structure in the center. And if you start by pu pulling in your tabs at the bottom, so I'm gonna um, connect and make a right angle, all right? So there's adhesive here, there's adhesive on the tab, and then you just fold in, right? And then this is our bottom. So this is going to, I'm just gonna put this down. It's really hard to do it in the air, but we're gonna, just uh, lay it right over, connect on the bottom, connect all the way around. And now what we've got, we've got a double wall bottom and two sides. And all we have to do is add our cute little handle. And what we do with this die, it's short. You just cut over a folded piece of 12 by 12 cardstock to create these little spider edges. And there's a little slit right here that this will slide straight into and out. And you just want to add some adhesive to secure it. You could add another sticker. You could do all kinds of things. I'm just going to, I can't talk and do this at the same time, but there you go. So we just pull the spider legs out just a little bit and you see how it just connects. And now all we have to do is decorate. So there are dies included and we have a spider web, right? So a spider web die, we have um, the interior sets. You can add happy haunting to this. You want to fill it with your favorite things. So tissue paper, um, maybe you love to bake. This is the perfect way to put a little treat inside for someone that needs to hear from you uh, around the Halloween holiday and what a special die set. $39.95. They were so incredibly popular. Uh, the item number is 853733. We have our final quantity if you want to grab those. I do have some beautiful papers that you can use to make that. It's a 60 sheet pack of spooky matte foil. Uh, already a customer pick with 24 reviews. You can see the beautiful purples and golds, orange, silver, and black. So this is what you're getting. You're getting all of them uh, in this look at you can see how many you're getting it's a, a big big uh pack of these with 60 of them and they are six by eight of the matte foils here's a card uh using that matte foil paper it's only 18 dollars 95 all right that is a steal of a deal seven 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 five six seven i know we don't have a lot of those so i wanted to show it to you um we're going to scooch over to this other table i've got one more item anna that actually wasn't originally supposed to be in the show so um this so we're going to mention it now and when it comes up I'll read it but it comes in a case and you're getting lots of of course everything that when Anna does collections like this they get a, a little box to keep everything in with a hook and loop closure they're mini Halloween stickers and embellishments so we saw actually this one on the uh, coffin vampire one and like the little kind of vintage paper uh, you're seeing that the cat the you know all the sentiments the little the little kitty cat happy Halloween so many of these Anna I don't know if you have these in front of you because we sort of pop these in at the end of the show. No, we have them. We have um, we have 60,000 square feet of all the crafts that we have made for HSN. Okay, wow. And so any time that you need something, we have it. So what's neat about everything that we make for our stickers and embellishments, this is our fo our product folio. It comes in a reclosable little box, all right? So inside, what you're seeing is there, this is 120 stickers. So we have six, uh, we have 80 that are all these wonderful things that say, 
happy haunting and best wishes. And then we have these miniature antique ephemera reproductions of stickers that you would use for creating your favorite Halloween cards. This little girl, right? She's a witch, but she has two kitty cats. Now she looks very pensive. Now there are antique uh, four color leaves and villages and pumpkins and flowers all included. So when you're making a collage for your Halloween cards, this is something I always pull, right? This is the set I look for. I go digging for, gosh, you cast a spell on me. Have a wicked Halloween. Boo to you, right? So the sentiments themselves are wonderful, but then these tiny little stickers, that winking owl, he's one of my favorites. He, um, he, he, he in real life, he is about four feet tall. Um, and that's what's really fun. That's why we call these mini, M-I-N-I, -I, um, Halloween stickers. So you can use, there are four each of each design. So you're getting four of those pumpkins in the set. We have four little witches and then we have four of the cast spell. So every time you see a sentiment, you're getting multiples of each one that we've used. Yeah, and again, this is exclusive to us at HSN on sale for $25.95. You do get this box with the hook and loop closure so you can keep them all. I'm telling you, I've got several of uh, these boxes of sentiments. They, they last and last and last. And on the outside of the box, actually, you can even see a little pictures of some of the items that are inside. Five flex pay of $5.19 and 120 pieces inside here, 120 pieces. And you can see uh, the trick or treat, a little cat, a leaf, a, a jack-o-lantern, and here's some of them. But Anna, this hour just flew by it. And I love that you've got your master control room there with all the products. <laughs> yes, thank you. Uh, we're, we're back at 10 o'clock for our final thing. We have all kinds of new, yes, new Halloween things that you haven't seen yet. Uh, okay. And new Thanksgiving as well. Oh, all right. Well, so we'll look forward to that. Thank you, Anna. 10 p.m. with Adam. Anna's going to be coming back. But we're going to continue here live at HSN. Coming up is uh, Suzanne Runyon, who is our master crafter here at HSN. She's got a special edition of her show for Halloween. So Suzanne gets crafty coming up next.